Okay, so we got a very interesting question. The survey of a square figure was conducted and square traverse was done. Okay, it is related to traversing. Find the bearing of other lines. If the bearing of line AB is 32 degrees, 45 minutes. Okay, it means that there is line AB. Okay, before drawing that, I'm just gonna have a directional map. Let's say this is north, this one is south. And we have a line making bearing here, which is actually 32 degrees and 45 minutes. Okay, this is line AB. Okay, let me just drag that over there. Okay, so this is line AB. Now, only data which is known is the forbearing of this line. Forbearing is always the bearing which is taken at the start of the line. Okay. So this one is the start and it's taken. This is whole circle bearing because directions like uh, northeast, maybe southeast, these are not known here. So that's why we are saying this is whole circle bearing. Now let's just draw a square, okay? Because this is a square traverse. And I'm gonna do this just a little bit roughly if I can do it. Let's say this is the square, okay? And we are asked to work out its uh lines bearing okay the remaining lines bearing like this is b this one is c this one is d now remember the only thing which is known is the four bearing four bearing i'll just write fb which is four bearing of line a b okay and that is actually 32 degrees and 45 minutes so simple now the back bearing of this line is needed so i'm going to say back bearing of line a b again remember where the back bearing should be remember this is a b and let me just draw a directional map again here this is north this one is south now remember the back bearing of line a b is always taken at the end of the line and that is going to be from north clockwise okay like this this is the bearing now remember 32 degrees and 45 minutes this is the same here okay now the back bearing is actually the summation of this bearing which is the four bearing up line a b plus this 180 degrees okay remember a bearing which is just this one let, let me just draw the directional map again so we can understand it better okay if you see that this is north, this is south, this is east, this is west, okay? So we start from north and that is zero actually. Now remember, this is 90 degrees, we have 180 degrees and this is 270 degrees and again zero, that is actually 360 degrees. Zero and 360 degrees, that is just the same thing. Okay, that's why I'm saying this is 180 degrees. This is 180 degrees. So 180 plus the four bearing which is actually 32 and 45 so the back bearing is actually now the four bearing which is 32 degrees and 45 minutes plus 180 which is this thing okay and it is 180 and it is actually 212 degrees and 45 minutes so simple now we are going to just determine the four bearing of B, C. So four bearing of B, C. I'm just writing B, C here. And that is actually, we're gonna start it from the north till the line. This is the four bearing. So simple. Now remember the back bearing of A, B is known from here to there. We're gonna subtract 90 degrees and because this figure is just a square and square has 90 degrees at each vertex uh, maybe you can say at each corner okay so this is 90 90 and 90 okay that means the four bearing uh, of bc is going to be the back bearing of ab which is 212 and 45 minutes because this is just the same thing from here to there and we're going to subtract this 90 degrees okay so minus 90 degrees and that's going to give me the four bearing which is actually 
at the line B C okay so simple so subtracting 90 degrees that's gonna give me 122 degrees and 45 minutes so simple you can make dash over there just to separate the degrees and minutes if you want does not matter okay now the four bearing is known the back bearing of BC is going to be if I draw directional map here this is north this one is south the four bearing is taken at the start now the back bearing is at the end okay and that's going to be from here to there okay clockwise from the north till the line now remember this is actually the 180 degrees which is this one plus this guy okay which is actually the four bearing of bc the same thing okay as we did for the previous one okay so the back bearing is actually back bearing of bc is actually the four bearing of bc which is 122 degrees and 45 minutes plus 180 and that's actually 302 degrees and 45 minutes so simple now let's just calculate the four bearing of cd okay the four bearing of cd is actually from north to the line okay that is just the four bearing and that's the same thing okay the back bearing of the cb or maybe bc that is from the north to the line that one we can just subtract this 90 degrees so we can get the four bearing of cd so simple okay so four bearing of cd that is going to be the back bearing of bc which is actually 302 degrees 45 minutes we're going to subtract this 90 degrees because this is square okay minus 90 degrees and that's gonna give me if i'm not wrong 212 maybe degrees and 45 minutes you can confirm that by your calculator does not matter okay so this is the four bearing now we're gonna calculate the back bearing up cd and that is actually if i draw the directional map here this is north this is south this is actually d okay and that is going to be from north clockwise till the line like this one so simple okay nothing complicated here so actually ju just look at here this is actually the same thing as this one okay if you see it so actually the four bearing of cd okay minus 180 which is this thing is going to be the back bearing which is this thing and these are the same okay so the back bearing of cd can be the four bearing of cd which is 212 degrees and 45 minutes minus 180 which is this okay that means 32 degrees and 45 minutes pretty amazing okay so simple now the four bearing of da that's gonna be little bit tricky okay so four bearing of da that is actually we're gonna just take it from the north clockwise till this guy okay now actually this is the back bearing of ad if you just count that if you just going from this position this is actually the four bearing of da so nothing just complicated here okay now the four bearing of da is going to be 180 degree which is from here to there this is 180 degree plus this guy okay and this is actually the back bearing of da and that this portion is actually from here to there and 32 degrees 45 minutes plus 90 okay so these things are actually the same okay this is actually 32 degrees 45 minutes plus 90 degrees okay so 32 degrees 45 minutes plus 90 degrees and this is the four bearing of da okay so simple and that's gonna be 
302 and 45 minutes. Okay, so simple. Now the back bearing of DE can be from north to clockwise, which is this one till the line. Okay, I mean, so the back bearing of DA that is actually this thing. Okay, 32 degrees 45 minutes plus this 90 degrees, which is actually. 122 degrees and 45 minutes so simple okay nothing complicated here this is how we can just calculate the four bearing and back bearing of any traverse line okay see you in the next video